Hey guys, Richard Holdner here for Speed Secrets. This episode is brought to you by the guys at Comp Cams. And unlike our other videos, there's no direct back-to-back -back test involved. In fact, we've already upgraded the camshaft on our ZZ454 crate motor. After we installed the Extreme Marine camshaft, we picked up over 40 horsepower, which was a nice upgrade. But the story doesn't end there. You see, this big block was destined for a boat application. But the owner was wondering, will I need to upgrade the camshaft if I decide to install a supercharger and upgrade the power at a later date? To find out, we set up a to test. To find out if our extreme marine camshaft responds well to boost, we need a boost. Now, boost for our 454 was supplied by an F1A94 supercharger from Procharger. We also installed an air-to-water intercooler. And just to keep things simple, we ran it as a blow-through carbureted application. Now we ran a couple of different boost levels, but we pushed it all the way up near 1,000 horsepower just to illustrate that yeah, that Extreme Marine camshaft has no problem with boost. So let's check out our test motor and jump on the dyno. Our crate motor had an Extreme Marine cam upgrade worth an extra 42 horsepower. Rockers and push rods came next, then up on the dyno. Nice broad torque curve. Then time for some boost. With a bolt on crank pulley and a variety of blower pulleys. That Pro Charger was plenty powerful and worked well with our air to water intercooler. Boost was fed to a blow through carburetor. Now the big block was ready for action. Anyone need an extra 400 horsepower? Okay guys, the results are in. And as you can see, adding boost to our big block had a dramatic effect on the power output. I mean, adding that F1A94 supercharger to the ZZ454 with extreme marine camshaft increased the power output by over 400 horsepower, which is not surprising considering that supercharger is capable of supporting over 1200 horsepower. But that's not really the point of this test. I mean, the point was to find out how well that Extreme Marine camshaft responds to boost. And all we can say is two thumbs up. It looks like the owner of this big block will be able to drive around with that Extreme Marine camshaft and have plenty of power. And also, if he wants to upgrade at a later date and install a supercharger and add some boost to increase the power output, he'll have no problem. I'm Richard Holder. That's all the time I have. I want to thank the guys at Comp Cams. Join me next time on Speed Secrets.